Today, we're looking at question three from the practice SAT mathematics test. Question three states, Jake buys a bag of popcorn at a movie theater. He eats half of the popcorn during the 15 minutes of previews. After eating half of the popcorn, he stops eating for the next 30 minutes. Then he gradually eats the popcorn until he accidentally spills all of the remaining popcorn. Which of the following graphs could represent the situation? All four graphs have the x-axis being time and the y-axis being the amount of popcorn left in the bag. A key thing to see here is that at the end, he accidentally spills all of the remaining popcorn. So the amount of popcorn in the bag at the end of our graph should be zero like we see in options B and C. Option B is our best choice because it matches the situation where he's eating popcorn, so the amount of popcorn is going down, not eating popcorn, and then gradually eating some more popcorn. Whereas option C, it's as if he went to get a refill for the next 30 minutes, and the num amount of popcorn in the bag went up. So option B is our best choice. For more SAT practice, visit numworks.com.